love the textured ID collection. I use the entire collection on my hair. It's I'm kind of like all exclusive to it right now and that's only because it has been doing me so well do y'all see this definition like my goodness so let's talk about how we're going to achieve it so I've already washed my hair it is freshly washed and conditioned using the texture ID coils then I go in with the daily moisturizing cream which is pretty much the leave-in conditioner for the texture ID coils collection and I use probably about a dollar size amount on my entire head and I just try to work that in then I go in with an oil, any kind of hair oil that you love will work. I go in with the Pretty Strands hair oil. It's the oil I've been using for a couple of months and it does me pretty well. It has a lot of hard hitting, uh, very good oils combined into one bottle and I absolutely love that. That's already pre-mixed for me. All I gotta do is just grab and go. So I do this as a scalp massage. I take the oil and it has a nozzle on it so I'm able to actually put it on my scalp versus on my hair. Going to go in with the Twist Butter by Textured IZ. Now this is the product that is going to make or break this definition in my TWAs. This is the only product I'm going to use. I'm not gonna go in with any gels whatsoever other than to lay my edges, and I didn't even do it for the sake of this video, just in case somebody tried to come for me and be like, well, since you said no gel, and you definitely using gel on your edges, I am parting my hair. I like to just start from uh, my the front of my hairline and part it going back like I'm doing like straight cornrows. And I probably do about eight of these sections in my hair. Get my hair clips ready and then let's get into doing some work. So I'm gonna first detangle my hair. As you can see, my hair's already kind of dry. So definitely keep a water bottle on hand because we wanna make sure that our hair is wet for this look. Wet hair is definitely gonna give us the definition that we're looking for once it is dry. Now to, time to add our twist butter. I go in with these three fingertips only. Products do not go on the palm of my hand whatsoever. They stay on these three fingertips and my thumb. So this is this is pretty much all I am using. And I'm just using my three fingers to rake the product through my hair. So we're also finger detangling as well as making sure that product is being distributed from root to end. Then gonna go in with my Denman brush and I am going to slowly pull those coils through. And I am just starting from the roots and just pulling it through slowly. Do not go fast on this part. If you go too fast, you'll end up getting a frizzy mess at the ends of your coils and it just won't look as nice and defined as this does. And as you can see, there's a couple of times that I snatched the brush a little too fast. You can see it's just not, it's not defining our coils the way we want it to. So make sure you're going nice and slow. If you hit a snag, detangle it out real quick and do one nice long and slow stroke through your hair to bring out those coils. Try not to be too heavy handed because of course the more products that we add to a tight four hair, the longer it's gonna take for our hair to dry, which can be super annoying, but once our hair is dry, the definition, oh, is amazing.
I like to do my little side part on whenever I do my TWAs. Right now, that's what's just working for me. I'm still waiting for my hair to grow out so I can get me some box braids because sis is trying to wear some box braids for the summer. For the time being, I'll just be wearing crochet wigs until I'm able to wear some actual box braids again. But when, when I can wear some box braids again, it is over for you. Over for all of y'all, okay? Over, okay? Either sit under a dryer or you can let it air dry me being the busy individual that I am with three kids a wife and a household to run I let that sucker air dry because I'll be running around doing any and everything else so usually by the end of my day of running all my errands running behind my kids and running behind my husband my hair is usually dry by the end of the day sometimes it can still be very damp especially in the center part where my hair is a lot more dense than of course around my edges then that will take probably a couple of days to dry but do not touch it please do not touch it once you have it styled and sitting the way you want it the coils are popping your definition is popping the product is in there do not touch it now I don't have a problem walking around with the white products in my hair. I know a lot of people, they probably be like, mm -mm, girl, I'm gonna have to dry it. I just can't be walking out of the house with clumps of white all in my hair. I don't care, I really don't. If somebody has something to say, I'm like, okay, it's my hair product. Don't touch it. It's, you see them coils, you see that definition? Don't touch it. There's a reason why it's there. Leave, leave it be, leave it be, okay? Let's go ahead and get into it, gang. So, to achieve my TWA natural hair, I don't like going in with a bunch of gels. Like, gels can be very, like, drying and hardening to me. And then my hair is color treated, so I try to stay away from products that I think are going to dry my hair out. Since I did not lay my edges, this look doesn't actually look that bad. Like, I'm okay with this. Like, usually I do, like, kind of lay my little baby hair, do my little swoop swoops up there. But, you know what? <laughs> Laid edges. I'm going to let it shrivel up, okay? Black parade. Let, where Beyonce at? Tell her to come here. She, I knew what she meant when she said that. When she said, but laid edges. I, I, I am, I'm her today. I'm her today. Laid edges them fading waves. I'm gonna let it dread all up. Cause I mean, can we normalize not having laid edges now? Let's let's do that now because these natural edges is serving life and you and I have thin edges to begin with. So doing all that laying, slaying and pulling and tugging, they ain't doing them no justice. So let me let my edges be free. Y'all done messed up. Y'all done messed up. See, I'm over here trying to do a no gel tutorial and y'all done messed up. Now I ain't, I ain't gonna go back to jail ever again. I'm lying. But you know, I, I won't for, <laughs> for this look for the time being. Now that I've given you the secret on how to get these defined coils without using gel, sis, when I walk up into Sally Beauty, I better see my products on the shelf because a lot of times I'll be like, hey, y'all, y'all should try this. And when I go back to get it, it's all gone. And then I'm going to be mad. I'm going to have my feelings hurt. 
because I'm like, I'm gonna share the secret. And now everybody walking around with these defined, beautiful afros, and I'm over here looking like a frizzy mess because I'm all out of proud. Now you saw in that tutorial that my jar was open. As a matter of fact, let me let me place my order on because I ain't playing with y'all. Y'all not about to do me do me like that. I'm gonna help y'all out and then y'all go out there and just start hoarding stuff. Like you don't 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 y'all act like y'all how y'all did with that tissue. Don't do that. Don't don't do that. So yep guys that is all that I use to get this nice and defined uh, wash and go def definition. Look at them at shriveled edges. Yes. Serving all the shrivels. I really do like the Texture ID Coils line. I've been, like I said, I've been using it for a couple of months now. It's almost, it's almost empty, so it's time for me to move on to something else. I don't like moving on to a new product until I use the old one, because then I end up hoarding a bunch of stuff, and I have limited space. I am not trying to become a beauty store over here hoarding a bunch of products. So, I, I'm sorry, I am rambling again. So. Thank you guys for joining us on another video. We will catch y'all on another tutorial. Please be blessed and be safe. Celebrating Black History Month. Peace.